Hello everyone. In this session, we will discuss some problems regarding the regarding this topic. The topic is compensators. Okay. Here, the first problem is he given G C of S equal to S plus A by S plus B. If G C of S is a lead compensator, find A and B. And here. For the first question, he given options. Option A is A equal to 1, B equal to 2. Option B is A equal to 3, B equal to 2. Option C is A equal minus 3, B equal minus 1. Option D is A equal to 3 and B equal 1. And the second question is, phi max is possible at which frequency? Okay. So for the first question, you should convert into the specific format. That is, for the solution, GC of S is equal to S plus 1 by S plus 2. So we will convert like this 1 plus S tau model. So for that purpose, 1 plus S into 1 by 1. This is the one format. And we can convert like this. Just if you common the two, then what happen? 1 plus S into 1 by 2. 1 plus s into 1 by 2 so now you should compare with the the proper compensator model that is the, that is 1 plus s tau by 1 plus s tau alpha this is the form 1 plus s tau by this is 1 plus s tau alpha okay so we can modify like this so finally i will write like this I will write this is the 1 by 2 and the remaining is the 1 plus s into 1 by 1 plus s into 1 into 1 by 2 shall we write like this why I am doing like this here the format is like this so I am converting as as based on the format so if you look at here if you look at here we will get s tau what is tau generally what is s tau here here s tau if you look at a value what is the a value here if you a value here and so finally we will write like this here we will get alpha equal to 1 by 2 here the alpha equal to 1 by 2 so if you compare this we will get the alpha equal to 1 by 2 for alpha equal to 1 by 2 which option it will be satisfied here alpha equal 1 by 2 then s plus a by s plus b this will be satisfied this will be satisfied why i am taking the first options i am replacing a, a equal to 1 here b equal to 2 then it is satisfied always alpha is less than always alpha is less than so that's why the answer is a so the answer is the a okay for whatever and what is the second thing here the second thing is phi max is possible at which frequency okay this is the second thing generally what is the formula for the maximum phase the maximum phase formula is 1 minus alpha sin inverse of 1 minus alpha by 1 plus alpha 1 minus alpha by 1 plus alpha by doing this we get 5 but the question is he is asking maximum phase at the at which frequency the question is so here i will write the maximum phase is possible at maximum phase is possible at maximum frequency here what is the maximum frequency maximum frequency is can i write like this we have two frequencies the here the first frequency this is for tau tau 1 is 1 okay and this is for tau 2 is 1 by 2 tau 2 is 1 by 2 from this we will get omega 1 equal 1 by tau 1 that is 1 omega 2 that equal 1 by 1 by 2 we will get the 2 so I will substitute in this I, I will get maximum phase equal to 1 into 2 omega 1 into omega 2 and finally we will get the maximum phase equal to 
रूट टू रेडियन पर सेकेंड रूट टू रेडियन पर सेकेंड ओके सो दिस इज द प्रोसीजर वेन एवर द प्रॉब्लम इज गिवेन लाइक दिस जस्ट सब्सिट्यूट द वैल्यूज इन प्लेस ऑफ ए एंड बी डू द सोल्यूशन वेन एवर इट सैटिस्फाई द लीड कॉम्पनसेटर लीड कॉम्पनसेटर फॉर्मेट देन द गिवेन the given options are correct otherwise go for the next option otherwise go for the next option otherwise go for the next option it is the verified method it is the verified method so generally maximum phase is always possible at the maximum frequency that is root to radian per second so what is the next problem here the next problem is a lead compensator network includes two parallel combination of rc in feed forward path so if the transfer function of the compensator is gcf is equal to s plus 2 by s plus 4 and the value of the rc is so he given compensator gain first the compensator gain is gcf s and the don't for don't forget it is the lead compensator because in problem he mentioned it is the lead compensator that is gcf s equal to s plus 2 by s plus 4 Okay, so we should modify it into the lead compensator form. Then you common the two, that is one plus s into one by two. The another thing is, if you common the four, one plus s into one by four, and one plus s into one by four. So this is the format actually. so this is the format actually generally so first we will look at what is actual format of the transfer function if you look at the lead compensator the lead compensator transfer function is like this so general transfer function is this is the format the format is r2 by r1 plus r2 into 1 plus sc r1 by 1 plus r2 by r1 plus r2 into sc into sc so generally this is the format actually this is the format so for this format for this format if you observe here just you compare with the above equation with this format so if you compare it generally this will give this r2 will nothing but the 2 and what about r1 plus r2 r1 plus r2 also this is the 1 and what about r1 plus r2 r1 plus r2 we can write r2 by r1 plus r2 in like that form so then we will convert like this and so from this we will write we will compare we will get r and c values what is r there here the r1 is r1 is the 1 by 2 there okay what about r2 r2 is the 2 not 1 by 2 actually so it is wrong actually so r1 is look at the r2 first r2 is the 2 therefore r1 is also 2 generally all right because the combination is there What about R2 by R1 plus R2? 2 by 2 plus 2, it will be satisfied. And what about tau? Tau is actually RC. Tau is R2C. So R1 into C, R2 into C. What is tau? So generally we will write tau. It may be the R1 into C as R2 into C. Here R1 into C equal. I will write like this: 1 by 2. That is the 0.5. That is the 0.5. Okay, just compare the transfer function with the the given formula. Then you will get the exact exact values. Okay, so this is the value of R C. We will get the value of R C as well as the R one and R two values. Okay. Move on to next problem. The problem is one plus three tau s by one plus tau s. This is the lead. maximum phase provided by the system is the question is maximum phase and given is the lead compensator 
so here the transfer function once again write down the transfer function that is 1 plus s into tau 1 by 1 plus alpha s into again tau 1 this is the format okay so I will compare both like this so 1 plus 3 tau tau 1 is I will write 3 tau s and what about tau 2 this is the 1 plus 1 tau s yes. okay here tau 1 equaled 3 tau okay and from that alpha tau 1 equaled tau again tau equal tau from this just replace tau 1 with 3 tau in this formula you will get alpha equal to 3 tau equal to tau so both tau will be cancelled from this alpha equal to 1 by 3 alpha equal to 1 by 3 okay just substitute in the maximum phase provided by the system formula so what is the maximum phase provided by the system formula the system formula is sine inverse of sine inverse of 1 minus alpha by 1 plus alpha so substitute these values sine inverse of 1 minus 1 by 3 by 1 plus 1 by 3 just by, by doing the simplification finally you will get sine inverse of 1 by 2 sine inverse of 1 by 2 from this we will get the maximum phase is the 30 degrees this is the maximum phase value that value is the 30 degrees okay so these are the some of the important models regarding the compensators okay i hope all of you understand the session thank you